Based on our investigation, Mr. Rennard's personal vehicle, which was being driven by a family member, had become snuck in the snow near his home. Mr. Renner went to retrieve his piston bully, or snowcat, an extremely large piece of snow removal equipment weighing at least 14,330 pounds in an effort to get his vehicle moving. After successfully towing his personal vehicle from its stuck location, Mr. Renner got out of his piston bully to speak to his family member. At this point, it was observed that the piston bully started to roll. In an effort to stop the rolling piston bully, Mr. Renner attempts to get back into the driver's seat of the piston bully. Based on our investigation, it's at this point that Mr. Renner is run over by the piston bully. At this point in the investigation, we do not believe Mr. Renner was impaired at all, and we believe this is a tragic accident. The Washoe County Sheriff's Office is in possession of his piston bully, and we are analyzing it to rule out any potential mechanical failure of why it may have started to roll. After uh, Mr. Renner was run over by the piston bully, there were some uh, neighbors that also brought out some towels to help. So, you know, I want to thank them as well for their quick response in helping Mr. Renner while all of us first responders were responding. But uh, first aid was rendered to him. I just wanted to clarify, you said he was trying to get back into the snowplow. Was he able to get back in and then was thrown out? or That part we don't know. Uh, we're waiting to talk to Mr. Renner. You know, he is a honorary deputy sheriff, uh, and so when I took office in 2019, uh, he came, and with um, his popularity amongst kids and the marbles, um, he has a huge impact. Um, those kids that he touched during Shop with the Sheriff, uh, he showed up and shopped with our kids. Um, I can guarantee they will never forget that moment that they got. He uh, shared his time with us there and not only shop with a few kids, but interacted with the kids. So he's had a huge impact, not only in this office in helping us with our outreach with Shop with the Sheriff, which is our biggest event, but throughout the community, he has been very generous. And he's one of those individuals that I can tell you, most of the time you don't know uh, that he's doing it, but he has made a tremendous impact on this community.